welcome back. Have you ever stopped to think about your brain and how it works? I think you should know and understand the very basic functions of the brain and how they impact you every day. Let's use your hand as a model for your brain. If you make a fist like this, then your fingers represent your prefrontal cortex. The prefrontal cortex helps us make decisions, problem solve and analyze and interpret our experiences. Now, if you open your hand, your thumb represents the amygdala. The amygdala is the most primitive part of the brain and is in charge of our emotions. When we are operating from the amygdala, we react quickly. Think, fight, flight, or freeze. Your palm represents the hippocampus. The hippocampus is important for remembering details and storing memories. Now, why did I pick these three areas of the brain as the most important today? Here's why. These three parts of the brain teach three very important lessons. The amygdala teaches us that sometimes our brain is flooded with emotion. Good news, it's not our fault when we feel overwhelmed. It's our amygdala taking over. Even better news, we can control that. We can learn strategies to overcome these amygdala hijacks. The prefrontal cortex teaches us that we need to help our brain help us make good decisions, think clearly, and control our impulses. Your brain controls all of your actions, and there are things you can do to stretch and grow your brain and to regulate your emotions. The campus teaches us that we need to strengthen and stretch our brains all the time so that we can remember everything we learn at school. Remembering is important. If you can't retain what you learned in eighth grade, ninth grade is going to be pretty tricky. Over the next few weeks, we are going to talk more about our brain and how it impacts our emotions and choices.